After being surprised by the great steaming performance of the Breville Bambino Plus, it got me wondering, which Breville is currently the fastest at making a latte? And because we now have every single Breville model in the lab, I spent the next day timing each one to find out exactly that. The first unsurprising discovery was that the machines with the same heating systems performed almost identically. So, for the sake of screen real estate, I've grouped the models together by their heating systems. The contenders in the race will be as follows. First up, we have Team Thermo Block, which consists of the Duo Temp, the Barista Express, and will be represented by the Infuser in the race. Next, we have Team Thermo Jet, which consists of the Bambino Plus, and will be represented by the Barista Pro. And then, we have two standalone contenders, the Dual Boiler and the Oracle. As always, all of these machines will be linked in the description below. First, I wanted to get an idea of pure steaming performance, so the first race I did was to heat up 200 milliliters to 60 degrees Celsius, starting once the machines were already up to steaming pressure. Ready, set, go. The Dual Boiler won the first race, taking 33 seconds, followed by the Oracle and Team Thermojet tied for second at 40 seconds, with Team Thermo Block trailing way behind, taking 58 seconds. But this result only tells a small part of the story. Because we started once the machines were all up to pressure, we didn't take into account the transition times between brewing and steaming. So here's that comparison. Because the Dual Boiler and Oracle both use a Dual Boiler heating configuration, they have zero transition time between brewing and steaming. For a single boiler, the Thermojet machines did relatively well, taking 13 seconds to get up to pressure. And again, the older Thermoblock models fell way behind, taking a whole 30 seconds. If we then look at the overall process times, by adding on a relatively standard espresso shot length of 30 seconds, the thermal block machines are in last place, taking just barely under two minutes to make a latte. Almost 40 seconds quicker, but still in third place, are the thermojet machines, taking 83 seconds. Now, for the dual boiler machines, it's also important to note that they not only transition instantly, but they can also brew and steam at the same time, meaning that we won't add on the espresso shot time to their totals, as those two processes are happening at the same time. This means that the Oracle sits in second place with a latte time of 40 seconds, and the Dual Boiler is in first place with a latte time of 33 seconds. Nice. As always, I'll leave all of the machines mentioned linked down in the description below. If you found this video useful, please leave us a like, and even consider subscribing if you want to see some more videos like this in the future. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.